Alice. I'm back again with one of my art journal pages. And in this page, the topic is, well, hunting dragons. Well, as you know, I'm not very good at organizing my pages. I'm creating on my mood. I'm not, I'm not following any kind of scheme. But something that I always do when I start my projects is using gesso. I cover my pages with gesso so that um, it works better. It works better with uh, with acrylic paint. It works better with the uh, uh, dilutions. It, go, it works better with uh, with all the distress inks. So it's highly recommended to use gesso in your projects. Uh, well, I'm using here also some glossy texture paste that, um, in fact, it, it dries transparent. But since the background is white, because I used yeso before, you will see that um, it gets white. While well, I'm using some inks to color the background. My idea was to make a sky, but I had to use only. Um, only a color and I chose green so that is a very light green that seems to be blue to to make this sky and after applying the, the ink the ink and spray I, I use a stencil with some acrylic paints because I use it first with um, with ink sprays uh, but I didn't like the result so I decided to, to use acrylic paints instead and a baby wipe to simply painting a plant using a stencil. You may notice that the bird is not colored uh, because I used some cello tape to seal it before. And well, there are a few stencils in which you can use this, this technique and this is one of them. You can cover the image and get a new stencil. Also, turning the stencil right or left lets you to a new to a new stencil to use in your your pages, as I'm doing here. Um, in fact, it doesn't seem it's the same stencil used. And well, I'm also using a homemade stencil with a dragon on it to to color the dragon. And I use black gesso because the result is gorgeous instead of using acrylic paint. Don't forget to let your work dry before you start uh, with another with another stencil or with another part of the project because if not, well, it blurs and the work is not as clean as it should be. So finally is the time for writing a, co a quote and this time is challenge, it's a dragon with a gift on its mouth. Time the dragon and the gift is yours. It's a beautiful co quote I found on the internet and I wanted to, well, to show it in my art journal because I completely agree with it. And the last part was framing the whole the whole project using a fake needlework. And well, that's all for today. I hope you had fun. And well, I see you on my next video. Bye.